haven't even said hi yet. Hi. <laughs> So we left Tiny and Phoenix with the babysitter. Woo! Yeah. And we're in the city. Why are you okay. smiling? <laughs> Saturday morning just wanted to give you guys a quick update I am at the vets I just picked up new medication for Phoenix because she actually had a seizure last night at like five o'clock didn't last too too long it was like a normal it was like a minute minute and a half uh, but unfortunately like I caught it like while she was in the middle of it so I didn't really start the timer like right away and then she had another one this morning and no one was around. We just saw that she was, like, wet on the side of her body. Um, and she had, like, saliva and, like, foam at her mouth. Because when she sees this, she, like, <sighs> does this a lot. Um, and it causes her to, like, foam a little bit. So we were like, oh, something is very wrong. Like, I called the vet last night. And they were thinking, since she had one two weeks ago, that maybe her phenobarbital isn't really being effective anymore. But which is unfortunate because she was on it for years and like no issue. So I don't know if it's just like the fact that we had moved and there's a lot of things that are different, but we've been living in this house now for a couple of months. So I'm not sure that that's the reason why. But when I called her old vet to tell them that we had moved, they were like, did she have any seizures? And I was like, wow, how do they know her so well? <laughs> so we're going to put her on. Levit Levit Levitiracetum for now and we're going to wean her down off of the phenobar because I think they have the withdrawal side effects for that too and I was like you don't need to put her through that as well so we're going to wean her down and uh, see how this works I think uh, I'm like super nervous because now it just always feels like before when she wasn't seizing that often like you know I wouldn't have a worry in the back of my mind that she's at home, like, having a seizure without us. But now, like, I feel like it's just, like, a like a ticking time bomb where she could just have one anytime and we could be anywhere. Hopefully, this is it. Um, but she had one two weeks ago, then she had one last night, then she had one this morning. So it's just, I'm having anxiety over it. I'm sure she is also having anxiety over it and... How I feel at this point is not important. <laughs> so the vet did suggest that, like, if we find out that this, let me try to say it again, levetiracetum doesn't work. Um, the other the other name they have for it is Kepra. I don't know if any of you Epi Warriors have used that. If it doesn't, if it ends up not working, then we may need to see like a neurologist, like a specialist for her because. I'm really not sure what else is going on, like if we can't control it with medication. Hopefully that's not the case and we put her on this medicine and everything is fine. We'll see. Wish us luck. Okay, okay girlfriend. Uh, Feeling okay? Well, my girl and I are here in the backyard. She freaking loves this bed. And uh, she hasn't had another seizure today, so hopefully that new medication is working. Although she has been like really wobbly. 
which I guess I don't blame her. She's on a lot of meds. Like, we're weaning her down on her other medication, her phenobarb, and now we're going to start giving her this, so. How you doing? You all right? Just lounging? She freaking loves this bed. Wake up. It's wake up time. It's wake up time. Is this what it's like to have a teenager? Oh my god. <laughs> Get up. We gotta go. Morning. We're on our way. Where are we going? Um, we're going to the... <laughs> we're going to the racetrack. We're going to the racetrack. You okay? We're going to the racetrack today and Mike is going to be... No, they're not. Cars are not racetracks. They're cars, sweetie. They're <laughs> Mike is going cars. to be a race dri race car driver today, right, Tiny? Yeah? Daddy's going to be a race car driver? We're going to watch him. We should have brought your little flag. <laughs> That's why you do it. What else are we going to do today? That's why they change the tires. They change the tires? Are you ready to see the, the cars on the racetrack? It's a beautiful day today. Oh, I feel like Bob Schliff next to the other way. Red race car. Mm-hmm. So, Mike is in class right now. And we're out here kind of early, right? But we wanted to check out the track. It is a beautiful day. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a racetrack. A racetrack. I see. <laughs> it's not a race, babe. Is this fun? Mama's the red one. The red one's your favorite? Is it because it looks like Lightning McQueen? <laughs> Alright, so where's your daddy? He's in number 53. All the way over there. There he goes. He's going faster than everybody. There he comes. Here he comes. He's coming in hot. You're heckling him? Go really fast! Go really fast! <laughs> there he goes, there he comes. That's him, that's him. Dada! Go really fast! Here he goes, he's gonna, he's gonna pass that guy. He's going too slow? Tell him to go faster. He comes he's coming around, he's coming around. That's him, that's him. There he is, that's him. What'd you say? Daddy, step on it. Step on it. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. It's too slow. Somebody else. It's not, it's not going. <laughs> it's not going to go. It's not going to go. No, this one's on break. Cheese. 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 <laughs> Say cheese. 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 Let's go. It's the pace car. That's the pace car. Pace car? Mm-hmm. So it's a pace. Yeah, it's pretty neat, huh? Come on, bud, let's go. Oh, you want another picture? Say cheese. Look at me. Look at me. Cheese. How are you feeling today? You good? Go, go, go. Oh, we're feeling better. Feeling better.
Do not go in the bushes. Phoenix, oh my god! Get out of there! What the heck? Get out of there! Okay, ready? You got a treat? Go inside! That's place. Go inside! Go inside! Girl! Sit! Sit! Good sit. All right. Enjoy yourself. I'm going to leave this open so you can come in and out as you like. I don't know. She really likes it in there. I don't think this is the permanent location of this crate, but we left it here so that we could keep an eye on her with the camera. So basically, if she was napping, I don't know. I, I don't know if we're going to leave it out in the house. I have, don't really have a spot for it. It's kind of like big and obnoxious, but I don't know. It makes her happy, so we opened it up. See you later, girl. See you later. <laughs> you don't have to stay in there. We're going to go open it up. We're going to open her up. <laughs> We're in the fast car. That's why there's no space for your legs in this car. <laughs> Oh boy. But that's not going yet. He's not opening it up. He's not opening it up yet. So we're back from the racetrack. We ate lunch. And Tiny's legs are really close to the back of my seat because we're in the Mustang. And we decided we we're going to take a little drive. We'll just make this like a fast car day. And maybe someone will take an NAP. We'll see. Fast car, put him to sleep. What's on our shopping list? Um, uh. What do we need to buy today? Um, food. Food, what kind of food? Bananas. Bananas, okay, what else? Um, all the bananas. All the bananas. Good job, buddy. How are you doing, girlfriend? Great job watering the bushes. Good job. Thanks for your help. Don't touch that phoenix. All right, let's go. We're done. Come on, Phoenix. Hey, you did good today. No seizures. No seizures. We are proud of you. I guess that new medicine's working out, huh? Phoenix? Phoenix? Treats? <laughs> High five. <laughs> High five. Well, you're still a very smart doggy. I'm glad you're feeling better today. Oh, don't cry. We love you.